What are you, like, what are your thoughts on, let me look it up just so I get it right, the crested partridge. The crested partridge. Well, I gotta tell you, it's uh, something to behold. Yeah. I'll give you that. Um, compared to other partridges, mm -hmm. uh, I think it offers a lot more vibrant colors. Mm -hmm. um, uh, just a lot more really to stand out on its own. Yeah. Um, whereas I feel like you need a, a full flock um, yeah. of any other type of partridge to, to get the same effect. Yeah. You know? Yeah. How do you feel? You think you, would you agree with those? or? I agree. No, they're beautiful, beautiful birds. Um, if you could have one as a pet, mm -hmm. would you or would you not? Um, personally, probably not. Okay. Um, just because, you know, I think birds need a lot of space, uh, especially a, a crested partridge. You know, they, they like to fly, mm -hmm. they like to roam. Um, mm -hmm. So I wouldn't be able to give them that currently. Um, would you be able to give them a pear tree? You know, I don't know that I'm prepared to uphold a pear tree, mm -hmm. uh, fill it with crusted partridges especially, yeah. um, and then and t and give them the amount of quality time they need to be tended to. I mean, I'd be, I'd be more than happy to start growing the pear tree, and if any partridges would like to come and use it, they're more than welcome to. Um, but as far as um, raising a partridge... From birth until death, right, yeah. I don't think I'm qualified. Okay. To each their own, yeah. We're going to bring in our guest now. Uh, his name is Zach Sharif. He is Woo! a local activist uh, in the Washington community. Come here, Zach. Come on, Zach. Right have here. a seat right in the middle. Yep. Thanks, thanks for having me, you guys. And Zach's coming in here today to discuss changes that he believes should be made to the Washington state flag. Yes. Uh, those of you who aren't familiar with the flag, it's a depiction of George Washington mm -hmm. um, on a very plain background, and there's not a ton going on. Uh, Zach, why don't you give us some of your thoughts? Sure. First off, thank you both for having me. It's, uh, it's a pleasure to be here with you all today. Uh, Matt, being an, a, a British native, is not a fan of any American flag, and so I just want to make sure we have that out in the open as well. Wow, that's like a very... We did warn them that you were a political activist. Sure. Yeah. I, I, hot takes. <laughs> hot takes. Zach yeah. brings in more hot takes than IHOP brings in hot cakes. Very true. Yeah. Very true. Uh, I try. I'm a big dessert guy, so... Yeah. That helps a lot. Fun fact, though, kind of kind of weird. I, cheesecake is my favorite dessert for all the hot takes and, and hot cakes being thrown around. Yeah. Which is yeah. a pie, by the way. It is a pie. Yes. Uh, but to the to the flag discussion, I, I'd love to know your thoughts too. Yeah. You know, I think um, it's just a tradition. It's a traditional looking flag. You get the green background. We are the evergreen state. We're the green background. You get George Washington's logo in the middle. I don't know, George Washington, Washington State. Kind of seems like, like what would you ch change it to? Sure. I want to hear that. I do agree. It's very traditional. Yeah. I like George in the middle. Yeah. I think it's a, a great tribute. Yeah. I do like the green. We're the evergreen state. Mm -hmm. I think that that's a nice tie-in. Uh, I, you know, I just like to see something a little more out there, something more representative of the state itself. Uh, you know, you know, maybe throw a fish on there. Something we we had a sure. discussion about. A, a I know you had a specific fish in mind <laughs> earlier. That's right, the, the rainbow fish the from rainbow the from the children's fish. book. Yeah, I think it'd be fun. It's it's recognizable. Um, I think it's great marketing for the state. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, even a Dr. Seuss flag. We could do a Dr. Seuss fish. Yeah. I'd be interested in that. Yeah. Interesting. Absolutely. Uh, let us know comments below. You have an idea for a new state flag. Put it in there. Tell us what you think we should put on there, or do you think we should just keep the current flag? Uh, we're going to leave that discussion open, and we're going to be back in about 15 minutes to get get in a little deeper dive on 